Hi, it's Alaska Granny. If you're prepping for any kind of an emergency situation, something you need is a hygiene kit, which includes a portable toilet. I like the Luggable Lou. It's a bucket that includes a seat that snaps on, and I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks to help make it useful to you, things to store in your Luggable Lou, and a way to actually use it so it's the easiest way, most convenient way, to clean it up. The first thing I did when I bought my Luggable Lou was fill it up with the supplies that I need so that it would have the stockpile when I grab the bucket. It has a handle that you can carry it and so you can take it with you whether you're going camping, whether you're bugging out, a hunting trip, or even going on a long car trip or staying in a van. You can use this portable toilet for times when you just need to go and a regular bathroom isn't necessarily available. Remove the lid from the luggable loo and you can store all kinds of supplies inside. I store them in a plastic bag so they're easy to keep together and I can lift them out when I want to use the portable toilet. Supplies that I keep on hand are rolls of toilet paper wrapped up in Ziploc bags to make sure they stay dry and clean for the use that I'm going to need them. I also have a roll of tall kitchen bags, the kind with the drawstring work the best for closing up your potty when you're done using it. Have some wet wipes, some plastic gloves, disposable gloves, and some hand sanitizer. Then if you want to keep down the stink, get some small scented votive candles and some matches. And in case you need some light, I have a solar yard light that I keep with it. And then if we needed to put it outside, find it in the dark, you can activate the solar light and it'll give you a little bit of glow to help you find it if it's outside in the night. I also have a roll of black plastic bags. Spread out some black plastic bags, open them up, and you can use some clothespins to clip around to make a shelter or privacy screen if you needed to. I have some Kleenex and one great big plastic bag that's big enough to go completely over you. So use it as a giant poncho so that you could put it over yourself while you're doing your business if you just don't have any other way for privacy. A good way to keep track of all these supplies when you're using a portable toilet is to store it with an empty five gallon bucket that you got from the grocery store for free. You can see the luggable loo fits right inside. You could just store it like this and you have the things that you need. All of these items can be inside but when you want to use it, pull them out Remove your luggable loo and empty all of the contents into the spare bucket. You'll still have them safe, organized, and clean all together so that they don't become lost while you're using your portable toilet. Always good to keep your supplies organized no matter the circumstances. Here's a trick on the easiest way to use your Luggable Lou portable toilet. When you remove the lid, you can see the lid is works like a regular toilet seat. It has a snap down lid and it snaps onto the bucket. But do you really want to just be going in your bucket? I went to the grocery store and I got one of the free two gallon buckets. It easily fits inside. It can be lifted out. So what I do is take one of the tall kitchen bags and I line this. Stuff it down inside. Make sure it's in there smoothly. Pull it around the bottom of the bucket and set that down inside. That's going to be the liner that stays in there to catch any accidents. Now you want to take one of your other bags 
And this is going to be the bag that you use to go. Open up your go bag, put it down inside, and snap on the lid. Now you can lift the lid, do your business, and add some sawdust, add some kitty litter, or just consider that that's it. Then you can remove the lid, close up the bag with your business in it, and a nice big bag is good because you can tie it up and then wrap it around a few times to keep it sealed in. Then you can dispose of it. If you don't have a place to dispose of it immediately, you can leave it in the little bucket until you find a place that you can dispose of your garbage, your trash, and your refuse. Now when, you, when you're done using the toilet, you can pull the bucket out, pull up this bag, close it up, and dispose of all of it. And you have this, you can rinse out if anything leaked, and your portable potty should stay clean and sanitary enough that you can continue to use it without needing a big bunch of cleaning supplies. Because sometimes in an emergency, a camp out, or you're traveling in your van or car, you don't have the water and the soap and all the facilities available to start cleaning out a big bucket that somebody went potty into. But you can easily dispose of this. And if you need to, you can use the wet wipes and some cleaners to clean up any spills or accidents. Having a luggable loo gives me a lot of comfort knowing that I have the hygiene and sanitation supplies that I need and it's come in very handy on times when I've taken my family out into remote areas. So if you're looking for a portable toilet that's easy to use, inexpensive, and a way to keep things organized and actually use it so it's not completely disgusting, try following a few of these tips for when you have needs that nature calls and someone needs to use the bathroom. Remember, everybody does it and we just need to find a way to make it work for us in any situation. Learn more at alaskagranny.com. Please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.